모든 산업인들은 산업 현장이 있습니다. All business people have their own field of business. 여기에 대해서 하나님은 정확하게 설명을 하셨습니다. And God has given us His very accurate explanation with regards to my business field. 하나님의 형상대로 인간을 만드셨고 정복하고 다스리라 이렇게 말씀하셨습니다. That is that God has created the mankind according to His own image, Genesis 1:27, and He has commanded us to rule and conquer the world. 그런데 한 90%의 산업인들은 거의 의식주에 많이 묶여 있어요. However, 90% of all the business people they are seized by all the necessities of life, food, clothing, and shelter. 막 거의 그러나 한 10% 정도 되는 사람들은 그걸 넘어서서 어, 조금 영향을 주는 이런 사람들이 있습니다. However, 10% of the people they have overcome the necessity of life, and then they are in a seat of being able to exert influence. 자 그렇다면 산업인 부분에 누구나 다 해야 되겠습니다만은 반드시 이건 확인해야 될 부분이에요. And we as business people we must evangelize. However, this is a specific area that we must confirm. 그래도 뭐 이런 속에서 어뭐 자녀도 기르고 헌금도 하고 대단한 거예요, 사실은. So in fact, in the midst of all the necessity of life, in the 90% of the population that we are trying to raise children, that we are trying to live. 그러나 힘든 거는 사실이거든요. Even though it seems very great, however, it's very hard. 그런데 한 10% 정도 되는 사람들은 <웃음> 영향을 입히고 쉽게 말하면 세계를 움직이고 이런 사람들이 나왔대. Whereas 10% of the remaining people, they are in a great seat of success, and that's why they can exert so much influence to the rest of the world. 우리 기독교인은 물론이고, 렘넌트는 물론이고, 산업인들은 반드시 알아야 돼. 어떻게 해서 이게 무슨 차이가 있냐는 겁니다. Not only Christians, not only our remnants, especially all of you business people, you must understand what is the difference here. 자 그런 것들면 지금 현재 세계를 장악한 3단체를 보면은 쉽게 이해할 수 있겠죠. You can easily understand when you look at the three organizations that have conquered the world. 예, 이 사람들은 여기에 속해 있지 않습니다. Because they do not belong to the 90%. 여기에 속해 있거든요. Rather they belong to the 10%. 근데 부끄럽게도 우리는 여기에 속해 있잖아요. So embarrassingly we belong to the 90%. 그리고 뭐 성교 안 하고 싶다 누가 있겠습니까? 성교를 하려고 하니까 경제력도 없고 힘이 사실 없는 겁니다. So there isn't anyone who does not want to carry out missions. <웃음> However, because they lack strength, they lack economic strength and power. That's why they cannot. 네, 이 사람들은 지금 현재 거의 이 세계 전체 영향을 주고 있는 겁니다. While the three organizations they are exerting their influence to the entire world. 네, 그렇다고 할때 빨리 답을 내야 됩니다. If that is so, you must quickly come to your answer. 뭡니까? What is that? 이게 강한 겁니다. They have this power of spirituality. 아, 영적인 힘이 굉장히 강해요. They have this tremendous spiritual strength. 네, 틀렸는데도 불구하고 굉장히 강해요. Even though it is completely wrong, they have great power of spiritual strength. 이 사람들이 창세기 3장 4절 5절 이건 이미 알고 있지 않습니까? And you know already that they belong to Genesis 3:4-5, 6:4-5 yeah. and 11:1-8. 어, 하나님을 떠났는데도 굉장한 능력을 설명하고 내피림 운동하고 바벨탑 운동을 한 거죠. Even though they have left God, they are able to explain tremendous power. They are in the Nephilim and they have built this Tower of Babel. 자 이쪽이 굉장히 강하다 말이에요. In other words, they are greatly strengthened in spiritual. 이런 답이 나왔어요. That's the answer that we have come to. 무당들이 틀렸지만 영적 힘이잖아요. Shamans, they are completely wrong, but they have that spiritual power. 우리에게는 이게 없다는 말이 돼요. Whereas we lack that spiritual power. 그래서 이 사람들은 이걸 가지고 완전히 이래 파고드는 겁니다. And with that, they have penetrated into culture and economy. 자, 그걸 가지고 문화 쪽으로 파고들고 경제로 파고들. With that spiritual power, they have plowed into culture and economy. 그래서 이 사람들이 삼차 산업을 다 장악했습니다. That's how they were able to seize the third industrial revolution. 쉽게 말하면. 삼차 산업의 가장 큰게 뭡니까? So what is the, the greatest characteristic of the third industry? 뭐 한마디로 얘기해 보면 디지털이죠. So simply put, it's digital. 이걸 장악한 겁니다. That's what they have seized. 
And out of many aspects of the fourth industry, what is the, the most important trait? The remnants need to So what is the key of the fourth industry? Biomedicine as well as all the semiconductor, that's what they're trying to do. But however, all these politicians, they, are, they fail to understand this. 그러기 경제 뛰어난 미국에 바이든 대통령이 와가지고 산업체 반도체 사야한 거예요. That's why this, all these great experts of finance, they in, they're in the United States, and the president of Biden, he came and visited a Samsung campus to see the semiconductor factory. 그도 왜 일본부터 안 갔냐? Why didn't they go to Japan first? 일본은 반도체가 우리보다 몇 배로 뛰어납니다. While Japan, they have so much advancement in the United s And they are greatly advanced to the point where they don't need to go together with the U.S. 그 and that's how they are quietly, completely seize the world. Whereas Korea, we are in a situation where we have no choice but to go together with the U.S. That's the situation of the third, fourth industry. 자, 이 사람들이 이걸 가지고 음악에도 파고들고. And with just three, six, and eleven, three organizations have plowed into music. 그게 문화 아닙니까? Isn't that culture? 경제도 파고들고. They've also penetrated into economy. 이렇게 된 겁니다. That's what's happening. 이래가지고 세상을 완전히 장악하고. That's how they have completely seized the world. 그런데 이 영적인 힘을 가진 복음 가졌지만 영적인 힘이 없으면 안 되잖아요. 복음 <웃음> 가진 영적인 힘 있는 자들이 있었습니다. Even though you have the gospel, you must have the spiritual strength. And these individuals with the spiritual strength arose. 뭐 사실이기 때문에 절대 놓치면 안 돼요. Because it was a fact, you must not lose hold of it. 자, 이 시대 때 벌써 창세기 6장 14절에 노아는 방주를 만들었고요. During this, this time, Genesis 6:14, Noah built an ark. 예, 이때 벌써 아브라함은 가병을 키우고요. And Genesis 14, 14 through 20, Abraham he had all these household soldiers. 아니 뭐 소돔 왕을 이겼다니까. And to the extent that he was able to win over King of Sodom. 굉장했죠. Isn't that tr- amazing? 여러분 아시다시피 벌써 이드로 장로 같은 사람 이때 벌써 어, 목축업 이런 걸 크게 하면서도. As you know, Je- uh, Exodus 3, uh, verses 1 through 10, that Elder Jethro, he had so much wealth and that he was running over, all, running all this farming and agricultural industry. And the congregation, or lay people, King David, he made a yeah. tremendous work that he built a temple. 이때 벌써 세계 영향을 주는 성전을 지었대요. He built a temple that was influential to the entire world at the time. 대단하죠. 성전 보러 막 오고 있잖아요. And many people came to see the temple that he built. 어느 정도 그 영향 줬는가? 바벨론이 와서 성전 쳐다보면서 아 언젠가는 이걸 공격해야 되겠다고 생각했잖아요. How influential was he that people from Babylon came and saw the temple and they came to their senses thinking that we must come and invade Israel one day and destroy this temple. 그러니까 이 영적인 힘을 가진 복음 가진 사람이 하나 나오니까 이런 일이 일어나는 겁니다. So when one individual, one business person with a gospel who has this tremendous spiritual strength arose, such works arose. 그래서 결론이 뭡니까? So what is the conclusion? 복음 안에 있는 영적인 힘을 가지고 공부하고 사업해라. You must do your studies, also do your businesses with the spiritual strength that is inside of the gospel. 안 그러면요, 이 속에서 굉장히 힘듭니다. 어떤 프로그램을 만들어도 힘듭니다. Otherwise, your lives have no choice but to be very difficult. No matter what kind of programs that you employ, you will you have no choice but to have face all these hardships because you're inside of the 90%. 누가 뭐 사람이 나빠 그렇습니까? 사람도 나쁘지 않은데 힘이 없는 거예요. It's not that people are bad, it's just that they don't have the strength. 여러분들은 그래서 힘이 없어 보세요. 이 걱정해야 돼요. So remember if you don't have strength when you grow up, you have to worry 그렇죠. about the necessity. 아니, 뭘 of 먹고 어디, 어떻게 살고 이렇게 하지? 이 걱정할 수밖에 없는 거예요. You have no choice but to worry about what, can, what am I going to eat, how am I going to make a living for my life. 이런 사람이 90%라는 사실이에요. And such people comprise 90%. 그런데 
이 10%의 사람은 능력이 있었는데 복음이 없다고 이게 더큰 문제가 되죠. But the 10% who have so much power and strength, they don't have the gospel. 이때에 복음 가진 산업인이 나왔다. At this time, a business person with a gospel arose. 그러면 우리가 뭐뭘 해야 될지 금방 지금 답 나왔습니다. Then you quickly can come to the answer what you must do. 조금 더 소개한다면은 오바데 같은 사람. If I can explain a little bit further, a person like Obadiah. 굉장한 파워 가지고 있어. He had tremendous power. 얼마만큼 영적 힘이 있었나면은 아합 왕도 움직이고요. 엘리야도 도우고 그렇게. How spiritually strong was he that he helped King Ahab and he also supported uh, Elijah? 힘이 있으면 그렇게 됩니다. If you have strength, that's what you can do. 자, 이 보세요. So look at this. 출세한 줄 알고 다른 사람 생각하는데 그래 생각하지 않았습니다. Many people thought that he just got promoted, but that wasn't the case. 네, 다니엘이요. Look at Daniel. 아니 왕궁에 바벨론 시대의 왕궁의 총리 정도 급에 들어갔다면 굉장한 겁니다. 그렇죠? During, during the time of Babylon, the Daniel, he was in the seat of being the chief prefect, the governor. That once means that he had tremendous promotion. 보통 사람 같으면 난리 나겠죠. Any individual, normal 예. person would be very excited about 예, that. 그 정도를 중요하게 안 보는 힘 있는 사람. But he has so much strength that he did not regard that to be important at all. 이런 하나님이 주신 것이기 때문에 여러분이 정말 맞다고 생각하면 역사 시작됩니다. Because this is what God has given to us. If you agree with this, then God will pour the answer the same way to you as well. 아 이게 정말 맞구나. 하나 순간부터 역사를 시작. The moment that you truly agree that this is true, then all the works will take place. 어, 제 같은 경우는 이것밖에 없다라고 생각하고. In my case, I think that this is the only way. 예, 복음 가진 영적 힘 있는 거 외에는 세상 살릴 수 없다. There's no other way to save the world other than the spiritual strength that is inside of the gospel. 그 사람들이 모인 게 로마서 16장이다 그 말이에요. And these individuals who gathered together, that's Romans chapter 16. 분명히 움직이잖아요. And absolutely they move the world. 그래서 영적인 힘은 이 사람들도 가질 수 있다. So even the three organizations can have the spiritual strength. 오히려 저 사람들이 가지고 세계를 움직이고 있다. In fact, the current situation is that they have it. That's why they're moving the world. 그래, 복음 가진 영적인 힘이 있어야 돼. But you must have the spiritual strength that comes from by having the gospel. 그런데 이 힘이 사실은 초대교회 한 번밖에 안 나왔어요. However, only once this was manifested through the early church. 예, 성경에 있는 요 사람들하고 초대교회밖에 안 나왔어요. That the spiritual strength was manifested through these people that I've mentioned and the early church. 예, 개혁 시대 있었는데 그는 조금 정치적으로 교리적으로 And even though we do see some people that appeared uh, during the uh, Reformation age, however, that was done politically and also doctrinally. 어, 정치적으로, 교리적으로, 신학적으로 그렇게 해보인 겁니다. They tried to restore it doctrinally, also politically, and also based on their theology. 어, 그러나 이 힘을 갖긴 좀 힘들었어요. However, it was very hard to have the spiritual strength. 자 그렇다면 여러분이 아무리 소수고 아무리 힘이 없어도 이 부분에 대해서 마음에 깊이 담아야 되는 겁니다. Which means that even though you are very few in number, even though you feel like you are nothing, however, you must embrace the spiritual strength in your heart. 그러면 초대 교회 이후에 지속이 되었어야 되는데 왜안 됐을까요? After the early church, this should have continued on, but why didn't it continue? 세 가지입니다. Because of three things. 어... 모든 성경을 다 외울 수도 없습니다. 나에게 주신 절대 말씀. You cannot memorize the entirety of the Bible. Rather, you must hold on to the absolute word that is given only to you. 왜 그렇습니까? Why is that? 말씀으로 하나님은 천지를 창조하셨어요. It is because God created the heavens and the earth by His word. 그렇다면 나에게 임하는 절대 말씀이면 되는 겁니다. Which means that it all takes is the absolute word that God gives to me. 그래 성경은 다 하나님 말씀이기 때문에 모든 걸다 적용할 수는 없잖아요. Because God, is, the Bible is God's word. You cannot apply every word of it. 예, 말씀 자체는 여러분 아시다시피 하나님이 말씀으로 천지를 창조해. As you know, just as one one God created the heavens and the earth by God's word. 예, 말씀으로 흑암을 꺾고. And by His word, He broke down the force of darkness. 이 말씀으로 모든 것을 창조하신 거예요. And by his word he created all the things that, he, that exist. 특히 뭐이 사절에서 십삼절까지 보면 
쭉 나오죠. As you, especially when you look at from chapter 1 verses 4 to 13. 이 정도라면은 이게 이 힘을 누리면서 지속하는 안 되는 이유가 요 부분을 놓쳤다. Which means that as you look, look at this progressively, that the only way that why people are not able to enjoy this continuously, the spiritual strength, is because they've lost hold of this absolute word. 꼭기는 뭐 그래서 예배드리고 기도하고 이, 이렇게 하는 겁니다. That's why in order to have this absolute word, we worship God, we pray to God. 근데 대부분의 지금 성도님들은요 영적 힘 없어요. However, majority of all these believers, they don't have the spiritual strength. 그러니까 아마 이게 코로나 회복되고 나면 교회 안 오는 사람 많을 걸요. And, and once that we the COVID-19 no longer exists then many people still will not come to church. 저기 됩니다. That's why people must come to their senses. 네. 지금도 영지 힘 있는 사람 같으면요. 덕평에서 여기 지금 어, 핵심 모인다고 꽉 참아야 돼요. People with spiritual strength 그렇죠. when they hear that we're going to have the core worship service here in Tokpeng RTC we must have the all the crowds of people gather in. 막 교회가 이제 코로나 해제되다면요. 교회로 막꽉 몰려 들어야 돼요. Now if we don't no longer have all these restrictions in the church then all the people must flock into the church. 그런 사람에게 하나님이 절대 말씀을 주시는 거예요. To such people God will grant his word. 그러니까 뭐 대충 영지 힘도 없고 그냥 교회 다니고 얼마나 힘들겠어요 우리 신앙생활 하는 게. People don't have the spiritual strength. They just barely go to church. Then their walk of faith will be very difficult. 아, 너무 힘든 거다. 이거 빼버리면 <웃음> 신앙생활 자체가 힘이 드는 거예요. If you lose hold of the word of God, that is absolute. Then you're going to miss out so much in your walk of faith. 그래서 막이 교회 뭐 문제 하나 생기면 막 크게 막 문제가 되는 거예요. That is why if a little incident that breaks out in the church, people 그렇죠? make a huge ruckus out of it. 이 힘을 가진 사람이 교회 문제를 봤을 때 어떻게 습니까 However, a person with a spiritual strength from the gospel sees the per- the problem in the church. What will the person do? 문제 안 되는 거죠. That's not going to be a problem at all. 그게 오히려 축복이 되는 거지. Rather, that is going to turn into a blessing. 그러나 이 힘이 없으면 내가 아무리 좋은 사람이고 아무리 바른 사람이라도 힘이 없어. However, if you don't have the spiritual strength, no matter how righteous you may seem, that how upright you may be, you will not be able to have the strength. You must quickly resolve this issue. 그래서 우리 다락방에서는 이거 빨리 해결해. That's why in 다락방 we must quickly resolve this issue. 그래서요 한, 하나님이 내게 이만한 절대 말씀이 연결되어 가야 지속되는 거예요. Only when you have the connection, the c- continuous connection of the absolute word that God has given to you, then you will have the continuation. 여 특징을 보세요. Look at these characteristics. 이 복음 누리는 영적인 힘도 물론이지만 절대적인 말씀이 전달돼 가다가 이 이후에 끊긴 거예요. As you have this continuous strength of the spiritual power, then as you have the transmissions of God's word relate to every situation, then you will have the continuation of this power. 그래서 2000년 만에 회복된 복음이라면 다른 사람은 오해해요. That's why when we say 그렇죠. that oh this is a gospel that's been restored after 2000 years, many people have 아니 그럼 지금까지 복음 없었고 다락방은 복음이냐 이렇게. They try to challenge and they criticize. Then are you saying that we do not have the gospel for all this time? 예, 정확하게 말하면 이때 이후에 영적 힘을 정말 가지고 세상 살리지는 못했다 이 말이야. Accurately spe- speaking, after the early church, we do not have the continuation of the spiritual strength to truly save the entire world. 이게 되어져야 내가 꼭 해야 되는 기도가 뭐지 알게 됩니다. Only when you have this connected. God's absolute word, then you will know what you must do. 그걸 보고 절대 기도라고 하는 겁니다. We call that absolute 그렇죠? prayer. 자, 왜냐하면은 하나님이 말씀만 주신 게 아니요. Why? Because God did not just give to us only the word. 분명히 다스리는 축복을 주셨어요. He has given us the blessing to rule and conquer. 그렇다면 무슨 말씀을 붙잡아야 되며 무슨 기도를 해야 되느냐 중요한 거예요. Then it's very important what prayer that you must pray and what word that you must grab onto. 모든 산업이는 내일부터 주일을 예배드릴 때그 질문을 해야 됩니다. All business people, starting from tomorrow when you give worship to God, you must ask this question. 산업인에게 가장 하나님이 준비해 놓은 게 뭔가 하니까. 복음 안에 있는 영적인 힘이에요. What is the greatest 그렇죠. thing that God has reserved for the business people is a spiritual strength and power that is inside of the gospel. 그리고 이거 확인하고 지속하기 위해서 예배드리는 거예요. In order to confirm it, in order to have continuation of it, that's why we give worship to God. 그래야만 내 혼자서도 기도가 돼요. Only then, even though when you're all alone, you can have prayer. 안 그러면요 망가지 질문 다 나옵니다. 뭐를 왜안 되느냐, 뭐 나는 안 된다, 어쩐다 망가지 질문이 다 나와. Otherwise, you will have all these millions and zillions of questions. Why is it not taking place for me? Why am I so lacking? And you will have all these excuses. 그런데 답 없어요. When you do that, you will not have an answer. 사람들이 주는 답처럼 보이지만 답안 있는. Even though what people say may seem like an answer to you, but it will not be an answer. 네. 
이런 메시지를 하나님 말씀을 렘넌트 확인한다는 것은 이거는 축복 중에 축복 기적이에요. It is the greatest blessing of all blessing as a matter of fact it's a miracle that you can confirm this message when you're a remnant. 왜냐면은 할 힘이 없기 때문에 확인하고 믿으면 되는 겁니다. It's because you don't currently have the strength 그렇죠? that's why you just believe it and you confirm it. 우리 힘으로 구원받은 거 아닙니다. 믿음으로 받은 거. We don't receive salvation by strength we receive it by faith. 뭘 믿습니까? 하나님이 주신 걸 믿는다 말이에요. We believe in what God has given us. 무조건 믿습니다가 이잖아. 하나님 주신 걸 It's not that we unconditionally believe. We believe in what God has given to us. 자, 이 축복을 하나님 주신 거예요. This is a blessing that God has given to us. 분명히 말씀하셨잖아요. And He surely said this. 우리의 형상대로 사람을 창조했다 그랬죠. According to our image, God created mankind. 정복하고 다스리라. And also He has given us this command to rule and conquer. This is a very first word that He has given to us. 그게 더 중요한 게 뭡니까? And do you know another word that He has given to us that's more important? 생기를 불어넣다. That He said Genesis 2:7, breathe the breath of life. 저게 기도입니다. This is prayer. 생기를 불어넣. He has breathed the breath of life. 하나님의 형상을 심고 생기를 불어넣. That He has put in His image of God into us. 고사 이의 이인. Breathe the breath of life, and in the midst of it, that we have Genesis 1:28. 절대로 절대로 놓치면 안 됩니다. You must never, never lose hold of this. 예, 이볼 보고 뭐랍니까? What do we call this? 보좌의 능력을 누린다는 거예요. Enjoying the power of the throne. 예, 이걸 빼버리니까 절대로 이 사람들을 이길 수 없어. If we lose hold of it, then we can never win against the three organizations. 예, 마을에 신자 많이 있어도 영적으로 무당 한명못 이기잖아요. Even though there are many believers in a village, but those number of people cannot overcome one single shaman in the village. 그러면 신자가 영적인 힘을 가진 그 있으면요, 그 사람 그못 이기대요. However, if there is a believer who has a spiritual strength, nobody else can overcome. 그만큼 영적인 힘이 중요한 겁니다. To that extent, having a spiritual strength is so important. 자, 이 축복을 누리고 나면은. 그냥이 아닙니다. 새로 나오는 게 있어요. If you enjoy this blessing, then you will see something that is new. 절대 복음. It is the absolute gospel. 복음은 그냥 복음인데 나에게 절대 복음으로 다가오죠. It's the gospel in and of itself, but it will come to you as the absolute gospel. 예, 기독교인이 거의 복음 능력 모릅니다. 이 복음의 능력을 아는 절대 복음이 내게 다고 있어. All this majority of Christians they don't know the absolute power of the gospel, but the gospel will become absolute to you. That's why you will enjoy the absolute power. 자 깨닫는 복음은 은혜죠. And realizing the gospel is by God's grace. 그러나 실제 상황에서 누리지 못한다 말이에요. The people don't enjoy this power of the gospel in the realistic, real life situation. 더 중요한 것은 무한한 하나님의 능력이 복음서 들었는데 그거는 더못 누리는 거예요. And also, we have this infinite power of God inside of the gospel, but people don't even recognize that. That's why you must hold on to this. 그래서 이것을 붙잡은 사람이 아브라함, 이삭, 야곱, 요셉, 그것을 가면 노아 다 그런 사람. And that's why those who held on to Genesis 3:15, the absolute gospel, would be Abraham, Isaac, Jacob, Joseph, and Noah. Yeah, 적각 주었잖아요. And immediately it was given. 네피림 시대 때 방주를 만들어. During the time of Nephilim, Genesis 6:14, build an ark. 야 절대 복음을 붙잡은 거야. In other words, they held on to this absolute gospel. 방주 안에 들어오면 산다. If you just come into the ark, you will live. 뭐 똑같이 이제 시작이 이겁니다. And the same way, this is a start. 갈대를 떠나라. Leave or Chaldea. 본토 친척 아비 집 떠나. And go from your country, your father's house. 내가 네게 지시할 땅으로 가라. And go to the land that I will show you. 그렇게 말씀하고. That's what God said. 자, 지금부터 지금 외국에서도 많이 메시지 듣고 있습니다. 어떤 면에서는 어렵다 생각하는데 저는 그렇게 생각하지 않습니다. Right now, many people from abroad are listening to this message, and they say that is so hard. But in my case, I don't think that's the. 외국에 있는 사람이라도요, 성령의 사람이면 알아들어요. If you are the people of the Holy Spirit, even though you are overseas, you will quickly understand. 나는 초창기 때 부산에 러시아 사람 많이 몰려올 때 러시아 말을 전혀 모르기 때문에 그 러시아 말 성기로 그줄거 가지고 가서 이러 이러. 
In the early stage of our ministry, I did not speak Russian at all. However, I just showed the Bible and then just pointed out the Bible verses, and they understood. You know, it must have been so frustrating for the other person to hear because I was just pointing out the Bible verse rather than speaking Russian. And it was a critical moment for the gospel to be preached, and at the time, a lot of Russian ships came to. And the reason why all the Russians came to Korea, Busan, is because even though we have about the same level of skill, just like Japan, but our cost is much cheaper. And because they were docking their ship in order to get their ships repaired, uh, that's why they just had to just wait. It was a prime opportunity. So I had to go there. However, I did not speak Russian. Even though I did not say a word, but only used my finger to point out the Bible verses, they understood. That's why all the people of God, the Holy Spirit, and all the disciples have no choice but to understand the word. Why must you have God's power within you? It's because the entire world has fallen into disasters. People are just covering up. They're in the midst of disasters. The entire world is in the midst of divisions. And utilizing all these words that seem to be nice, they're saying that oh, individual rights, and that's why they're creating divisions rather. If you receive true answers, you will not cause divisions. It's not about your personal rights. It is about the, uh, about the other person who's going to be really regarded. It's not your position, but the church is more important. If you truly understand the gospel, have the power of the gospel. More than the work in the church, people who are dying in the field, they are more important. It's because people don't know the power of the gospel, that's why they don't understand the true priorities. Perhaps one and two we can understand. 지금 현재 전 세계 교회는 문 닫고 있습니다. Right now, all the churches of the world are closing down. 교회 폐쇄되고 있습니다. The churches are closing their doors. 여러분 교회 건축 빨리 하고요. 세계 교회 살려야 돼요. Quickly complete your church construction and save all the churches of the world. 여러분이 힘을 있는 거라도 다 팔아서 교회 빨리 확실히 만들어서 전 세계 문 닫는 교회 구입해야 돼. All the positions that you have, sell them off so that you can really save your church first, and then so that you can save the rest of the churches in the world. 예, 빈땅 있으면 갖고 있지 마세요. 다 팔아서 교회 내에서 세계 복음을 준비하세요. If there's any empty land or empty properties, go and purchase them so that we can build all these churches. 예, 그게 초대교회였습니다. Because that's what the early church did. 초대교회는 세계를 정복했잖아요. The early church they conquered the world. 예, 결국은 뭡니까? So ultimately, what is it? 우리가 이 힘이 없으면 결국은 모든 것이 손해가 됩니다. If we don't have the spiritual strength that comes from the gospel, in fact, everything will become a loss. 오늘 전국 세계에 있는 어, 산업인들 이 메시지를 붙잡고 또 파고들고 파고들고 기도해 보세요. All these business people throughout the nation and throughout the world hold on to this message and really delve into this message, deeply meditate upon it. 여러분에게 정확한 날에 응답 올 겁니다. Then in the most accurate timing, that day God will answer you. 기도하겠습니다. Let us pray. 모든 문제 해결자이신 예수 그리스도의 은혜와. Now may the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ is the solution to all problems. 하나님의 영원하신 사랑을 신고 성령님의 무한하신 능력의 역사와 전국 세계 산업인들 위해 렘넌트들 위해 지금부터 영원까지 항상 함께 계실지어다 아멘